Hey guys, Kate and Sydney. So this is our video for Jenna Marbles, and um, here it goes. Dear Jenna, so I was walking in the hallway. Was it today or yesterday? Let's say today. Yeah, let's just say it was today. And I was walking up to one of my friends, and she gave me this face. And I thought, oh my word, I just watched that video last night from Jenna Marbles, and I thought to myself, that's the same face I gave my ex before he left on New Year's Eve. And that's the same Indeed. face he gave me, but then I... I did the Velociraptor, and he left. So, I definitely think. So yeah, that's a that's a success story on your um, your face uh, uh, suggestions. That so that that was a definitely a success story. That, that definitely definitely the vo as you say the Velociraptor. I think that was probably the most that that probably worked the best. I think so. <laughs> I like doing it because it's fun. But, um, yeah. The Velociraptor was definitely genius. I don't know about the dog. But I did attempt the Lady Gaga one with the face. The <laughs> yeah, actually, come to think of it, my, I had an ex-boyfriend that actually used to do the dog randomly. Like, he, he, he would actually, it wasn't just like a random, like, like barking. He would actually, like, you know, start to growl and stuff like that. And he would, he would shake his head and start to growl. That's strange. Oh my. Indeed it was. Indeed it was. But, um, obviously we know most of you guys are probably Jenna Marbles fans and Destinate. And uh, we figured that we'd throw in a little bit of what you can find at Walmart. I know that this has already been done by Destinate, but I feel I feel it was kind of unfinished because, really... The true wonders of Walmart can never be completely explained. It's That's it's true. it's just it's limitless. It's endless. There is just so much amazing stuff at Walmart. It, it's just it, you can it's find fish at Walmart. I don't know about snails. I haven't seen those yet. I'm pretty sure they probably have in the freezer section for the French people. Escargot. Okay. <laughs> I haven't seen any dogs though. No dogs in Walmart. Um, you think they would let a a dog in Walmart, like, let, like, a, a guy dog in Walmart if it was for a blind person? Do you mm, think there's a possibility. I don't know, but I've never actually seen a blind person in Walmart before. Mm. I wouldn't know. That would be really cool. I wonder how that works, though. Because yeah. they say that, like, your your senses, your sen that senses, your senses are very <laughs> heightened when you're lack of sight. So, you think you'd smell, and, like, you know, like Destin Nate said, they, always, they, they say the heart, Walmart smells like, what was it, Justin Bieber vomiting on Whale Diary or something to, to that effect. Um... But yeah, like so. Yeah. We wonder how that smells to him. Or like, because if I were a blind person, and you know, that would probably oh just make me just you know hightail it out of there with my dog, and you know, it's <laughs> tail between its legs, because you know, <laughs> Walmart doesn't smell too pleasant to begin with, unless you're no. like in one of the ones that has like a Subway or like a, a McDonald's or something. That's you just true. Chill over there I mean, it could be a very creepy place, especially people just walking in there in their pajamas. And, like, some people that have missing teeth. I do that's feel like I'm walking into a slumber party sometimes when I go to Walmart. Because there's so many people that do not know how to get dressed. That's true. You know, like, we may wear jeggings and, like, moccasins and leggings and stuff like that. But and these people wear, like, their legit, like, Spongebob sleeping pants, pajamas, pajamas, to Walmart. Exactly. And, like, you know, just, like, a tank top or something like that. And they're slippers. They're slippers. When they they're go through, actual, you know, like... Spo matching Spongebob slippers or like I don't even know I can't <laughs> people are just ridiculous and like, then you know. then when you go to look in there for just something simple you you go to ask the person and they can't give you like a full fledged answer it's like it's, it's a scam I tell you it's a scam it's an AL12 yes cause like okay I want the macaroni and cheese oh we have an excellent selection of stewed tomatoes. I didn't want stewed tomatoes. I wanted macaroni and cheese. Oh, well, I just thought that, you know, maybe some stewed tomatoes would go yeah. nicely with your macaroni and cheese. Well, I didn't want stewed tomatoes. I wanted macaroni and cheese. Now, can you kindly point me to the aisle where Did the macaroni you know, and cheese is? Have... Or, or there's just 
a very like just creepy family that looks like children in the corn and they just walk up to you and say hi you don't you don't even know who they are and this girl like the little girl would walk up to you and they go she goes oh check out my barbie and we're like the best part about what? walking into walmart for me as you can see see all this metal on my face i love when little kids come up to me and they like stand there and they point and they just they just point at my face and they just, they just stand there and then yep. the parents eventually walk by and they see what they're looking at and they just they slowly grab their child's hand and they walk away and just yeah be like don't don't look at her just it's don't like look. okay first of all we're not freaks no, we're not we scared. are normal people and that's what one thing that people don't get is the fact that normal what? people can have fun too you know yeah or you know be be sadistic masochistic freaks and have a whole bunch of holes in their face you know whatever whatever works for you yep and one more thing that we want to add is that basically oh another place you can go into is target that's always fun target is fun i was actually just discussing this today you know them giant red balls outside of um target they're like these are giant concrete yeah. balls at one time I was on Facebook and I saw a picture of someone standing on top of one and there was like a whole bunch of condom, co condoms comments, comments on it <laughs> that said, are you standing on top of an exercise ball? And I'm like thinking to myself, have, has, have they not been to Target? Yeah, like, really. seriously? I actually, at first when you look at it, you think it's almost like either a giant kickball or like a bouncy ball. So you go sit on it and then you try to kick it and you're like, Oh. Yeah, and you break your toe or something to that effect, and it just, it's not pleasant. It's really <laughs> You're just like, oh, mom, check out the giant. Oh, never mind. Yeah, it's just, it's, it's deceitful is what I tell you. Just like, like, okay, this is completely off topic, but snow, okay? I have the biggest problem with snow, because snow is the most deceitful thing in the world, because it's just like rain, but it promises to be wet, I mean, to be, to be dry, and soft, right. and it's white, and then when you step in it and stuff, it's all cool, it's all cool, it's a little cold, but then as you get into the warm area again, it melts in your socks. It's deceitful, it's rain, don't let it fool you. Yep. Well, hey guys, thanks for watching, and you know the drill. Like and comment, and subscribe to my videos, and there will be more ranting and singing and whatever else you guys can think of that I could put in my videos for you. Where is so, that for suggestions? <laughs> Alright, see you later guys. Bye!